So the exercises we're going to do today are for anybody who has any restrictions in and around their armpits, which may be causing problems in terms of movement and pain with their shoulders and arms. These exercises are a nice, easy way of starting to release some of those restrictions, undoing the fascia and allowing the muscles to move more freely. We're going to start with the side bend. So just making sure that you have your legs comfortable distance apart. We're just going to start by leaning over to the side. So keep your arms nice and heavy. Allow your head to drop over and be heavy. Keeping your body nice and relaxed. You'll start to feel a stretch in your side. You may start to feel it in your waist and then coming up into your ribs and then eventually up into your armpit. And if you want to have a deeper stretch and it's comfortable for you, you can bring this arm up and over your head. And this will create a deeper stretch, particularly into your armpit, your arm, your shoulder. So as long as you're in this stretch for at least 90 seconds to two minutes, the fascia will be starting to release and let go. And then you can come out and repeat that on the other side. The doorway stretch is a great way to open out the whole of the front of your chest and also your armpits as well. To do this, just use any convenient doorway, place your hands on either side of the doorway and take a step through. You will feel a stretch across the front of your chest and down into your armpits. Just make sure that your shoulders and your arms are relaxed, you're not tensing, so that the fascia and the muscles can start to release. So as you're here, you need to just stay in the stretch for a couple of minutes and you'll start to feel things let go. If you find that you want to get a stretch into different parts of your chest, you can move your hands up or down to different positions on the door frame and you feel a stretch in different areas. If on the other hand you find that having your arms up is too uncomfortable, then you can stretch one side at a time. And to do this, just come to the side of the doorway and just turn away from the door and you'll start to feel a stretch into your chest. So a great exercise to do for helping to loosen your armpits is to use a myofascial ball. So you can either use one of the large inflatable balls or a smaller trigger point ball, whichever is more comfortable for you. So we're going to be working with the ball on this area on the side of your armpit towards the back. If you feel in this area, you will feel there's a line of bone, which is your shoulder blade, which goes from the top of your armpit down your ribs. And that's the area we want to work on. So we're going to place a bowl on that area and then lie on the floor. So allow your body just to relax around the bowl. So let your head go heavy. If it's more comfortable, you can put a small pillow in here. And just wait for a sense of things letting go. As long as you're here for 90 seconds to two minutes, then the tissues will be starting to undo. So you may find that doing this exercise on the floor is too uncomfortable, mainly because your armpits are quite tight. So in which case you can do this against a wall as well. So using either one of the big inflatable balls or the small trigger point ball, you can place the ball against the side of your armpit and then just lean against the wall. So just allowing your body weight to relax around the ball, this will encourage the fascia and the muscles to start to release. And as long as you're there for 90 seconds to two minutes, then you will be getting releases happening. And then you can move on to a different point and just wait for things to release again. So these exercises are great for anybody who has restrictions or pain when they move their arms and their shoulders. And it's a good way of gradually improving the movement and reducing the pain. 
Balls that we use in these exercises are available as a kit from our website, pinkhead.co.uk.